All right, we're back here at Hoover Dam. All right, y'all, so I've got three rods, but I'm gonna mainly just use two of them. This one's gonna be same as last time, uh, night crawlers. And this time I got real unflavored night crawlers, none of that garlic stuff. And then here, we're gonna start out with the tomato shad. had a bite from the night crawler. Took most of the worm. But they cut the generator off now, so water's gonna start dropping. Here's something. Oh yeah. Not a keeper of course, but first walleye of the evening. Typical size for down here, about 11, 12 inches. Uh, a lot of y'all pointed out in the last video that some of the fish I was catching were sauger, and it had been so long since I caught a sauger that I forgot how to tell the difference. But yes, there's a bunch of sauger in here too. If I catch one, I'll show you the difference. The main one here to look at with the walleye, that white spot on the bottom of the tail. We gotta be 16 inches to keep. Here's one. <laughs> Lucky on that one. Not a keeper, but it's a catch. Well, here we go, another nice little walleye. Ooh, I think something just followed it. I saw a boil right after I pulled it out of the water. There's one, there's one. I felt that one hit it. Walleye number three, another little guy. This, this is the smallest one so far. Pretty fish. Pretty tasty too, just can't keep this one. There's a fish. Walleye 
on number four. No sauger yet, all walleye. Well, four walleye so far after they cut the generators off. All on the tomato shad suspending jerk bait. Just an Academy store brand jerk bait. And uh, had a few good hits on the night caller, but no. Fish yet, no hook ups. There's something. There's a fish. Feels like another little walleye. Yep. Something's taking the night crawler. There we go. Surprise, surprise. A baby catfish. Seems to be the only thing in this river that will eat a night crawler. Little baby channel cat. But hey, first fish on a night crawler. This tomato shad has been doing me good. It's been serving me well. But I just want to switch it up and try another bait that does me well. That being the old Smithwick's Rattling Rogue or Pro Rogue, whichever one it may be. I don't, honestly don't know the difference. I'm like somebody shooting some fireworks. And there's something down there. I think it's the scum. I, I just feel some kind of a weight. It's not a fish. Yep, it's the scum. Got into a shallow spot. Looks like we got some gravel out. I can pull this canoe up here and fish here for just a minute get that night crawler back out well we got another one. Oh, we felt a lot bigger than that these fish fight kind of like rock bass if y'all know what I'm talking about a lot of people call them red eye, rock bass, black perch, whatever. They uh, they hit real hard and they just don't fight much after that. The walleye are biting tonight. Still haven't caught a sauger. Still haven't got a keeper either, but can't complain. Fishing's good. Oh shoot, I've already got a fish on this night crawler since I threw it over there within a minute. There he is. It's not big, but it's not small. It's it's okay. What do we got here? <laughs> what? Is that a hybrid? I thought it was a yellow bass because of the size, but that's not a yellow bass. It looks like a little hybrid. A oh, white bass, white bass, striped bass hybrid. Hard to tell. It's kind of a small one. We'll put on a fresh night crawler here. It would make my night if I caught a keeper walleye on a night crawler, but so far it looks like the uh, jerk baits are winning in the walleye game. You never know. Every fish in the water loves the night crawler. Already getting another fish on the night crawler. We got him. Not sure what this is.
Hey, it's another walleye. All right. Cookie cutter size, good hook set. There it is. Ooh, it looks like a walleye, doesn't it? I saw his eyes first. That's the biggest one of the night. I don't think it's a keeper. No, it's not a keeper, but I'm, I'm gonna measure just to be sure. Nope, it's not gonna make it. It's 15. That's right at 15. Not a keeper, but that's the biggest one of the night. Pretty walleye. And I caught it on a night crawler. So that's why I'm putting night crawlers out right there. Even if I'm catching a bunch of baby catfish and other weird fish, it's those walleye is what I'm after. All right. <clears throat> My last worm is rigged up with the same rig, except I've got two hooks on this night crawler. I won't catch a fish. I already got one within a minute. There's a the fish. What do we got here? Catfish. We're gonna try to save this worm. We got the whole worm. Old catfish. So I'm gonna give this a shot. What I'm using here is just a Zoom Super Fluke on a four out wide gap hook, weightless. This one's got a chartreuse tail. Ooh, there's a fish. Check it out. Well, it looks like the weightless fluke works. Still not a keeper, but the walleye seem to be into it. I guess I'm gonna start fishing my way towards the ramp. I figure they're gonna cut the generators on any minute now. Just hooked into a fish by the ramp. It's a trout. Hmm. That's my first brook trout. That's a pretty fish. Now they stock these in here, so it's not like a wild fish. You can tell it's a hatchery fish because some of the fins are rubbed off. The tail and then this fin here is rubbed off. But still, really pretty fish. That's my first one ever. I'm going to take some pictures of this and let it go, and then we'll call it a night. 